Hey, welcome, welcome, welcome. I just dropped some cats. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I can't see. Can't see. Look at my cute little, my cute little pom pom. Anywho. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. Kai, no, no, don't do it, Kai, Kai, don't do it. Let's do my little, uh, Leo's, okay? So, we're gonna do our look. I'm sorry. Hi. Hi. It's late. It's chaotic. And I stopped at Starbucks. So. So, there's that. Here comes Kai. Here comes Kai. He's like, Mom, here. Yeah. I'm here, mom. Here, where you been? Where you been all day? Where you been? Where's my bestie been? So, how about you not nibble on your mother or or my cats? How about you mind your business? How about you mind your business? What are we trying to say? Free yourself, okay? Free the energy. I just got the goosebumps. Whew, I don't know what that means. Apparently, you need to free yourself from something, okay? Strongly. All right, my little Leos. So, like, clearly, very soon, you you need to figure this out. Leo, Leo, Venus, We're getting to know each other. You know, we have what is this? This could be the one, and then we have deception. Somebody's wearing a false mask. To me, this is not necessarily that type of deception. This is somebody's just lying to themselves about something. Or something. Or, or something, okay? Very soon decide what it is you want, and they want you to stay optimistic when you make this decision, okay? Did I just scare you? I'm sorry. Love yourself first. Here's the deal. We got, we got some, you don't have enough love for yourself. Some of you do not. Some of you, okay? Or some of you will put in somebody else first. But we also have release your ex, which to me, this is straight up release your energy, okay? And we have engagement. So Here's the thing, and then we got honeymoon at the bottom of the deck. So I'm telling you right now that um, whatever this is can escalate quick. I am not done. So we got very soon and staying soon, very soon and staying optimistic. Okay, we have getting to know each other and love yourself first. So here's the thing: like at one point, somebody did not have this self love or, or what this is. Okay, but. They're saying, you know, give yourself the best fit of the doubt. You know, this could be the one. But you, you need to let go of energy that you're holding on to. All right? To me, this is self-deception with the lies. Okay? If you can confess about how you really feel towards this person, um, this can escalate, you know, a lot quicker than you think it can. Okay? Um, I need that air on me. Sorry. So, you know, decide what it is. But, you know... When you make this decision, try to look at the positive things versus, like, the negative side of things right now, okay? Um, it's just, it's important. They, they, you know, they want you to get to know, they want you to get to know somebody. Um, so release any negative thoughts that you have right now, okay? Regardless if there was deception or not, if there's been enough growth move on. To me, I feel like you've just been lying to yourself about who this person is, to be honest with you, because for it to jump from there, from that to that, you've been, you've been keeping your distance from somebody. This is what this is telling me, okay? So, let's find out your best advice for the new moon, for my, for my lions, for my, for my lions. No moon energy for my lions. Wow. Wow. The Knight of Wands, okay? And it's looking towards the past. So what this is saying, they're giving you the energy right now to let go of the past. I know that might seem complicated to some, but what... <laughs> release it, it's, it's letting you release okay a lot quicker 
if you try, but you, you need to put effort into this. You need to take action to release whatever this is, okay? Which is the seven of swords. You've, you've been lying to yourself. You, you, you've been lying about something, and it, it's time to, to let this go. So to me, this talks about feelings because or speak up and tell the truth, okay? Tell me about this Knight of Wands. This is why I'm saying, like, release this energy. It, it's going this way. Like, even the birds, even the dark, dark birds are going that way. So whatever it is you've been holding on to, talk about it. Let it go. The Hierophant, okay? Um, you're holding on to negative energy from somebody from the past, whether it's this person or some type of relationship, okay? You're holding it against somebody, Let it go. Release. You have to. If you want to enjoy life again, you have to release the, the old and let it go. Okay. And now the the energy. They're they're giving you the energy to do that. Okay. You have the three of cups. So, you know, you want this happy, happy. You want you want to feel this again. You know, because looking right up. I'm like, you want to feel this again? Because look at you want you happy, right? This is looking right up at release your ex. Like to me, this is this is energy from the past. Release it. Like how ironic is the way? Look at this, looking right up. It's killing you. It, it's tearing you down. You the, you can't be growing right now. You, you like you're stagnant in energy because you're lying to yourself because you're not letting go of something that's caused pain and, and you're still in the pain kind of you know release it please release this please go get a massage do something take care of yourself nurture yourself okay you got three sevens in a row with the seven of, seven of wands you're you're just you're so incredibly guarded and i just said that you're, you're self-sabotaging this but here's the deal it's, it's giving you this energy, this quick energy to release it, okay? Anything else for the new moon? Take advantage of it. If you need to express, express. If you need to release, release. You definitely need to do all the above. But, like, this could work and see, this could work for you if you do it the right way. The Ten of Wands and, and the Hermit, okay? So you're coming out of Hermit mode, which is great, but you're still carrying a lot of weight. So... It is time to let this go, okay? Tell me about the hermit. It's time to, to lay the weight down. It's at the 10th, all right? Stop stop lying to yourself. Whatever this is you're lying about, speak the damn truth or stop lying to yourself, okay? You've already soul-searched, all right? The hangman, this is what I'm saying. Like, you need to change your perspective right now before you get caught up in some stagnant-ass energy. I, I'm not kidding right now. They're giving you this opportunity to speak the truth to step into something new, get rid of the heartache, be able to let your guard down, take advantage of this. If you don't take advantage of this, you're going to struggle. Please don't struggle. The Queen of Cups, nurture whatever this is, okay? You got the devil, but here's the thing. This was a karmic tie. This is something strong. This is this is quite the bond, too. You're very emotional over this bond. It just... It, it just wasn't time when this all took place, okay? But if you want this, they're saying nurture it. To me, you got to nurture yourself, too. You got to look out for you right now. Like, no kidding, you got to look out for you. And, and I would do it real soon, real soon, because there's that five of pence at the bottom of the deck. You want to stay lonely? Oh. Going on, my Leos. There, there's somebody you want to get to know, okay? But you're hesitant. You you gotta you gotta take care of yourself in order to go to this. But I'm telling you, you can. It's the energy. The energy right now is to take care of you. There's that five of cups and there's that fear. There's another seven, okay? It, it's dwelling on the past, all right? Like you're sinking in the past. You got somebody right in front of you, but you you're still. The past pain is holding you back. Release it. Let it go. This is the damn energy to let it go. I don't know 
you there's that wheel reverse. You want to do that again? Don't let your past pain stop your future endeavors. It'd be foolish because you're stay stagnant. All right, I, I don't want you to stay stagnant. And the full moon's coming. Don't stay stagnant. Take advantage of this, my little Leos. Strength. And it, it's hard. This is a battle. You you fought battles in the past. No question. You've been fighting battles for a long time. But it's, it's time to, to have the strength to, to step out of that battle. Fight your own demons. All right? The king of chalices right now. You know, like, nurture something. Go, go nurture something that's... Nurture you. Nurture something that's tired. You know what I mean? Like, I want to say own up, and I don't even know what that's all about. And you got the Knight of Swords. So this is... I think there was some type of deception, too. Uh, as if other men, other women, it's something. And whatever pain you're carrying, you have to release it, Okay. You, you just, you have to. This is also talks about coming in, you know, a swift message type thing and having the strength to do it and, and being able to talk about what needs to be talked about the right way. And here's the Hierophant, you know, and I, and I was just saying, talk about something the right way and you might have to own up to something. There's 11-11. You might have to own up. This is the Nine of Wands. This is talking about it. Letting your guard down. Stop fighting. Stop fighting the beast and have this type of conversation. There's no need for hostile. There's no need for back and forth. There's no need for, for bullshit. Cut to the chase. Be honest, be truthful, and speak what needs to be spoken. And get yourself out of this energy. That's why I said own up, because somebody needs to own up. Got the tool of swords, you're being indecisive. Hangman reversed again, so you're coming out of it, but don't sit in this for too long, okay? Um, you've been watching this person for a while, too. You're definitely attracted to this person, but in a very, um, in a very, soft, compassionate way, like, like tender in a very tender way and if that's the case go after that that's beautiful it's like tender love and i understand why it's hard to get to but um you can do it okay um tell me about the tyra font something you know, temptation got in the way of, of whatever this is. And, and now you recognize what this is. And there was some toxic, toxic shit, okay? Um, this is heavy. But looks like you want somebody's forgiveness and vice versa. What was I clarifying? The Hierophant, the Ten of Chalices. Yeah, you're, you're happy, okay? Um... It was reversed, so you're, you're unhappy, but like, because you don't want to talk about this. Got yourself in a pickle. You're the two of swords twice. Don't be indecisive. Get out of this energy. Tell me about this night up. Knight of Wands. This is you getting out of it. Yeah, see the Ten of Wands. Put the damn weight down and step out of it. Step out of it. Put the damn weight down and step out of it. And like, put the weight down. Look who's holding who. It's, it's not saying it like that. Like, put down that weight. It, it's put the weight down. All right? The weight of probably you sneaking off or, or being sneaky with someone else. I mean, look how sneaky you are. That's like sneaking off. And, and doing something real quick with somebody and, 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 you know, going back wherever it is you went back to. And there was definitely another person involved here, okay? Lay the weight down. I'm not saying you're with that other person now. I'm just saying that's bothering you still. So whether this was done to you or you did it to somebody, talk about it. 
because what you have with somebody else is beautiful and it's tender. It's up to you whether or not you're going to go after it. Okay? It's up to you. You have the six of swords at the bottom of the deck that, that talks about, you know, getting out of stormy water. All right? Moving, moving forward. So I hope you take the advantage of the new moon to, to move forward. Okay? So I keep seeing, you know, judgment and grief and you're stressing yourself out right now too. Health is big lately with stress, okay? And and swallowing your pride right now is not an easy thing for you. Lesson for Leos. All right. You got service. You feel good when you help others. And, and stop doubting the scenario. Um, but here's the deal. Right now, you're not open to seeing two sides of the story. So either someone did this to you or vice versa. And you're just not ready to confront it. But the universe is going to push it towards you. Okay? So why not address it? Because if you don't and you hang on to this type of energy, you're not going to grow. I think you think, you, you know, you could probably just dismiss this and, and move on, but this will this will catch up. This has been sitting with you for a while. For a while. So. This is your opportunity to push through. It's a harsh lesson. It's a hard lesson. Okay, but... You can do it. Learn from it. Move on. Because as soon as soon as you do, um, <clears throat> there was denial again. Denial. As soon as um, as soon as you do, trapped. All right. As soon as you do, um, holy crap! What are you doing? As soon as you move on from this and, and release and, and talk, whatever it is that needs to be an open, you're gonna feel so much better. All right. And this. Here's we go with the traps. All right, do you see that you cannot do what it is you really want to do or what others expect from you, or do you not feel fulfilled? Do you feel as you never get what it is, or you never get to go the way you want to go? Have patience, for truly this is a temporary imprisonment that only exists in your mind. Your circumstances, no matter what, they will change, and you'll be free to experience life as you wish and lead in so many ways that you thought you couldn't, especially when you feel defeated. In these times, dreaming is your best antidote, and of course, patience. Consider the story of the half-raven boy of conflict, trapped in conflict until, until he finally follows his hat. Trust in me, and I will show you when the cage door opens, so you can, so you can fly free. So what this is saying: once, once you follow your hat, your soul, this tender love that you got down here, you won't feel this way. As soon as you talk about what needs to be talked about, you won't feel this way. You'll feel free. You'll feel like a free bird. Okay, look at this one trapped. Don't you want to be like like Kai? Okay? Don't you want to feel free? All right? You're doing this to yourself. Please don't stay in this energy for too long. Do you understand what the universe is giving you? And he's confirmed quite a few things in this reading. He hasn't done that lately. I'm telling you right now, the, the new moon is giving you this energy to, to push through this and leave this in the past. And go after what it is you're desiring. I wish you the very best. I love you.